And then I have all kinds of items basically from my travels and from the natural world. Uh, one thing that's really cool, that's kind of like from the plant pagan uh, natural magic world is I keep blossoms of plants. Like these are peonies. These are uh, rose petals. And this is the nine powers. All of these, actually not the rose, but, but these two are harvested from my own land. And uh, they carry different energy and I actually burn them in a sensor, you know. And for example, peonies, really, really incredible stuff, by the way, you guys. This is like Venusian energy, like very goddess-like, very, um, you can use it in love spells, or you can just burn it because they smell absolutely heavenly. They smell like cotton candy, you know, like no incense needed. This is everything. I burn this all the time, you know. It's also just really great for evoking goddess energy and I mean it's just the best smell ever a rose has the same type of smell it's actually like very very sweet you know so rose is amazing the nine powers it doesn't really um, I, it's not really called the nine powers in English I don't remember anymore what it's called in English but in Estonia we call it the nine powers and you can like make tea and whatever and this one I burn as well, but this doesn't smell that good. It's just when I need like to regain my personal strength, I do a little intention setting with that plant. It's incredible. And then of course I have all the typical, you know, um, sweet grass. This is Native American. So you're supposed to kind of like clear your space with sage and then do sweet grass, which is supposed to just kind of remind you of the sweetness of life, they say. Um, I also have here um, mugwort, which I harvested myself as well. This is like Estonian or like Nordic witchcraft type sage. This is our own sage, you know, it grows everywhere. It's uh, extremely powerful. Um, it's considered actually one of the first plants in the world. So it's ancient as well. And then I have some other plant magic things. Here, these I just have like as, as totems or tokens or like whatever. This is, um, I don't know what they're called in English, but you know, it's that mushroom that has like white dots on it. And uh, it's also used for like shamanic journeying. I have actually never used this specific plant myself because I want to do it with somebody experienced if I ever will. But um, yeah, in the Northern tradition, Northern shamanic tradition, they actually journey with this. So I picked it from my own forest and just kind of keeping them as like, tokens of appreciation for my ancient culture. Um, yeah, of course I have Palo Santo. It's amazing, smells so good. And from the natural world as well, I have, um, I have actually a deer spine that I found in the forest here. And uh, this is a piece of a deer spine and um, the deer animal totem is supposed to kind of remind you of happiness and light and just kind of like playfulness in life. So I keep this because I tend to be pretty a heavy, heavier person, meaning just, just I process things very deeply and very emotional. And um, as well from the natural world, I have these swan feathers here that I actually gathered myself as well from this really powerful little island in Estonia. And these, all these swans live there. So I use this, you know, to just do like healing and, um, and um, how to say, smudging, yeah, smudging. And I also have uh, all my like oils, which I burn natural oils. Um, I have this Tibetan bell because yes, sound is a vibration and you can change the vibration by creating sound or like just listening to sound. 
It can also clear out like stuck energy. Sometimes I'll like clean my house and I'll just go into corners and like. Ooh. And also for sound, I have this this magical shamanic instrument that I made that I actually learned from this Estonian sauna shaman that did a ritual on me and she had this instrument and I was like, what is this? This is absolutely incredible. So yeah, she told me to kind of just like, there's this one tree, I don't, I'm sorry, I don't know what it's called in English, but um, you kind of cut the, the trees, they're like, you know, and, and you dry it. And then you put like, make these like 10 centimeter long uh, little tree things. Now I haven't been in America for so long, I'm starting to forget English. And uh, you put them unequally, like there's 21 and 21, 42 total. And you can just create this like little shamanic sound thing. To me, it kind of like reminds me of like the rainforest or like something. It just has like such light frequency. I love this. And what else do I have here? Um, I have an onk. These are new. You might have seen them in my artwork as well. Uh, onk is the symbol of light and huge fan of Egyptian goddesses over here, you know, especially Sekhmet. Um, so I don't know, I just feel really connected with this symbol right now. And, and I had this like custom made by this Estonian artist. It's made of uh, iron. They say that they're supposed to be um, always kind of like yellow or white to symbolize the sunlight. But I actually wanted mine to be black for shadow works. Journeying to your own darkness so that you can heal it. I have so much to talk. I have so much to talk about when it comes to shadow works, you guys. And this one is like a temporary edition right now that I got as a gift in Estonia. This is a love potion. Ooh. And uh, I showed you this one actually in an Instagram story once. But this is really cool. It has all these like different spices and like all these different plants that are supposed to kind of attract the love of your life, which I don't really want to right now. We drank it with some friends, but um, I'm the love of my own life right now. So I'm saving this for when I want to share my journey with somebody. So yeah, this is my little sacred space. Um, I hope you guys felt connected to something and uh, you know start drying your own uh, peony blossoms next summer. It's really a lot of amazing stuff in the natural world and I wish you many blessings and a lot of love, integrity, love, unity.